If you guess the exact number I'm thinking in my head, I'll <laughs> I'll give you uh, fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> you you guess the exact number. <laughs> you, you dead ass. Yeah, I'm dead serious. Okay. Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> give it a ring. Hold on, hold on. Let me give it a ring. I appreciate it if you coming through. You feel what I'm saying? See my wear for the break. What's going on guys? Welcome to this week's video. Thank you guys so much. What a guy, bro. <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome to this week's video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. It's going to be a very eventful video. We actually have DDG coming down. We have a great experience with him. You guys are going to find out if you bought a new watch, if you traded his watch in, what he ended up doing. It was really fun to have him down and a few other special guests. Also, we're going to be showing you guys some sales and some other eventful things that happened throughout the week at the office. Thank you for tuning in and let's get into the video. I'm on a whole nother level, I'm geeky. You think you fucking with me, but you tweaking. Ready for war, I just need me a reason. I'm getting buckets in regular season. Honestly wondering when I'ma lose it. Come get your wifey, she with it, she choosing. Maybe I be driving yourself, I be crazy. Looks sick on the trap too. Yeah, hard. You're actually the first guy I've seen that uses the travel box like properly. Right, yeah. yeah you're supposed to carry it in that. Yeah, it's very nice, bro. What you got? Like, I'll show you. I ain't trying to break the bank. I ain't coming. <laughs> now we'll, we'll try and set you up to like a good trade. Okay. But that's a good piece to like to start out trading into, you know? Yeah. That's that. People don't even start there. That's a good piece to have. What other watches do you have? I got the AP skeleton. But yeah, these are the these are most of the riches that we have in stock right now. And then I'll bring out other stuff too. Baby blue, this is hard. How much is something like this? Uh so that watch is 225,000. It's an arm 30 black <laughs> 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 How much is this? Uh, so that's a gold Toro. Gold Toro is three hundred ninety-five thousand. Three ninety-five, huh? Is that right? Okay. But that's Ooh, it's so that's a thirty-five. You see how the skip face is like a skeleton too? And this is its uh, twin brother. This is called the Black Toro. Both of these are the same watch. This is just ceramic and rose gold, and that's of course full rose gold. What's this? How much is this joint? That's a really cool piece. So that's a black bubble. So it's limited to 50 pieces in total. So this is the white bubble, the one that I'm sure you guys have seen. Yeah, uh, but to give you an idea, they made around a thousand of these, like 999. They made 50 of the black. There's a few variations. That's the all black Seems variation. Like wearing that or something. I think he does have one. The guy who made that watch like really famous was Dan Bilzerian. Mm -hmm. So oh, Dan yeah, Bilzerian yeah. was wearing a bubble in like 2013 or 2012. This uh, but this is the black variation. Jake Paul actually wore a fake bubble. He For got, real? He got called out. Oh shit! Yeah, Carl, Carl nah, boxing bro, we, we, we made we made a video <laughs> on that. And, like we tried to call him out, but like, yeah. For real? Yeah, and then he bought like I think a week later he went to St. Bart's. He bought an actual like, eleven over the Mons. Yeah, that's it. Crazy. But he was he was wearing a fake bubble. He put it on his belt and shit. Like, yeah. Damn. They nah, I mean, what, what do you need to buy a real one for? Yeah, I mean, Jake Paul. What? How much is this? Uh, so limited 50 pieces in the world. This one has boxing papers and it's 315,000. 315. Okay. I gave you this. How much is it? Uh, so difference on this. This has boxing papers. Yeah. What is the box I got? Okay. So half half box and papers you have, right? I mean, the other box at the crib. Okay, then that's perfect. Um, the boxes are interchangeable, so it's not that big of a deal. Yeah. Um, but the papers for sure. That, yeah, that's important. Yeah, for sure. Trade difference, we would do about 125,000, which is me giving you 190 for this. 125 on top would be 315. I watch you were just holding his 1.8 million. Do you mind me asking what you paid for that? You don't mind? 280. 280. When did you buy it? It's a turbulent time. It's crazy. Oh my God. I'm holding two million. So I. I, I don't want to say that it was way too much, but respectfully, I think that they might have uh, might have got charged a little bit too much, in my in my opinion. I mean, I know they got to make money, but still, you know. So that watch I sold yesterday um, for 191,000. 
different guys. See what that does. So they, they, they did get pretty high. They were up to about 200 and like 40, 250,000. I didn't see them at 280,000 to be honest with you. So I think- uh, What do you think to eat? So what are you trying to say yeah. right now? <laughs> I think, I think, um, yeah, it, it's a lot of money for that watch, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. You gotta meet me somewhere. I mean, we can work with you a little bit, but you gotta work with me a lot of bit. We got, cam <laughs> we got cameras coming out. Y'all making money. I'm making money. A hundred percent. I'm willing to work with you a little bit, but um, yeah, two two eighty is yeah. is tough. That's uh, that's. You tough. bought that watch in the states? Two eighty. Bought it in New York. I got all the straps. I mean, yeah, I got the straps too, but you know, you ain't got this one, dude. We oh, actually we just, just sold ours. Yeah. Have you seen the camo it. one? I think you'd like that one. Yeah, that's, 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 it. that's my favorite one. Yeah, that's that's favorite one. one. This is our. How much is how much is this? White oh. bubble is gonna be three hundred thousand. How much is this one? Uh, this we're asking one ninety. One ninety? Yeah, it's limited to hundred pieces in the world. What's the highest the bubble's reached? Bubble went all the way up to about four hundred and twenty, four hundred thirty thousand at one point. I think the most, the highest we sold one was about 300 meters. You think it's going back? Um, I think that arm's pretty stable right now. They've been doing very good, to be honest with you. And the, can't actually like, so the, I'm not sure if you saw, but the past year, the market went down a lot. So, like, skeletons, for instance, they were like $400,000. At one point, rose gold skeleton. Some, some even more. Today, they've almost got cut in half. Um, RM has done the best, to be honest with you, compared to all the other brands. It went down probably like 20, 25% some a little bit more like 30 percent but uh for instance the bubble went down you know four let's say 400 to 300 it went down 25 percent mm -hmm. overall this is an iconic watch it's a watch that a lot of arm collectors look to put in, into their collection i think it's going to remain pretty stable in the near future as far as going back up uh it's very possible it's very possible honestly with what's happening in the world right now i wouldn't be surprised to see a lot more people buying watches i don't think people are going to want to keep money in the bank or crypto People are scared right now and they're buying assets cars watches houses stuff like that i don't know if you guys saw but like a couple banks collapsed crypto is going crazy so i think people are going to be buying assets um so i think bubba's pretty safe and in terms of like did you write that down before you said it <laughs> no no i'm serious <laughs> i'm serious bro that that's one of the easiest watches to get in and out of you know if you ever want to sell it like super easy to sell it's like the most liquid yeah, yeah. model for rm which is a good thing too. This is good one. So is RM11 just at the, at the right price point. Yeah. So here's some very serious APs. This actually just came out. I don't know if this is your style. I think you like the Chrono more. Yeah, no, actually, let me grab the Chrono I for you. Like this here. Put it right here. Damn. Don't uh, DJ oh, Cali right. this yeah. Yeah. Sean, how much are we asking for yellow, gold, rainbow? This Frosted? Um, 595. <laughs> but at, at one point, that watch was worth like 950. Crazy. Man, baby. Yeah. Fuck no. Hell no. That is crazy. How long has this been sitting? Uh, well, we've had it for, I think, like three months now. But we sold like three of them in the past. And it's limited, supposedly, 30 pieces. How much is this one? Yeah, we actually have that at really good price. Over this one. Over this one. That's 200. But that's no papers. You got no papers for this? No. A lot of arms come with no papers because, like, a lot of them have Which ones you got papers for? Uh, we have papers for a lot of them. Like, both of these have papers. See, this is something I think you'd like. Bubba has papers. If you want the to white something from AP. This just came out. It's fire. It's a black ceramic chronograph. So, I'm sure you've seen, like, the perpetuals or the black ceramic skeletons or stuff like that. This is really nice, though. Yeah, that just came out this year. Um, so this watch is 140,000, and the retail on it is around 90,000 from the store, 85,000 plus tax. But to get that from the store, you gotta spend like millions, millions with that, yeah. you uh, know? All right, I wanna see how much you think this is. Feel it, feel it. Let's see. Wait, guess it, can I get it? <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. If you guess the exact number I'm thinking in my head, I'll, hey. I'll give you uh, $50,000. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> you guess the exact <laughs> you, you dead ass. Yeah, I'm not serious. 
Okay. Let me see. Give me the ring. Give me the ring. Keep your phones in your pockets, by the way. Hold on, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on, boy. Hey, y'all, come below. Hurry up before it's too late. I'm going to split it with y'all, niggas. Wait a minute. Okay. You can't get no range nothing? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Can I ask you how much this is? Yeah, no problem. How much is that? Uh, this is 145,000. How much is this? Uh, that's 285,000. Okay. Then that must mean this. Can you give us info on it? Uh, it's limited 50 pieces. Okay. It's titanium. Thank you. We need this info. It's a green dial. Okay. It's, green dial. Um, was green. made for two years. Mm -hmm. Um. I don't know what else to, to do without giving it away. I don't think you should give it anything. <laughs> so, okay. It's only I would 50 say. Pieces, so round. How many round. pieces is this? Uh, don't, that's actually not limited. That's not limited by amount of pieces, but I would guess there's probably maybe 50 pieces of that as well. But that's Six, 600,000. 600. Very close. Oh! Okay. No, you don't get to go yes. off of my answer. <laughs> yes. You can't give it Very to him close. now. That's yes. actually a really good guess. 62. That's a really good guess. 550,000. Very good guess. Ooh, what, if I would have really oh got it, you would have really gave me 50 bands. I'm a man of my word. You would have gave me. <laughs> I'm a man of my word, I promise you. But I knew, I, go back I, I, knew, so bad. I, I knew for sure that there was no way you're going to be able to guess it. So. Google said 350. <laughs> <laughs> How did you get that out already? Yo, that's what I'm saying, bro. You got to watch the phones. How much is this? So that's an ARM 29 Japan edition. It's also limited to 50 pieces. It was only sold in Japan. 265,000. How do you know these prices so quick off the top of your head? Yeah. Uh, I like watches a lot. Yeah. I study all of the inventory. You had an extra 10 on top. We know. <laughs> <laughs> so that's an ARM 1103 Ultimate Edition, and that's 575,000. What do you think about the new RMs? Have you seen them before, like the 72? They're making like them a little bit smaller, sleeker, like, more elegant. Yeah, these look like more female though. So that's kind of, that's a good, that's that's good that you noticed that. So that's the direction that they're heading, like more unisex. They want guys and girls to be able to wear them. Yeah, girls, girls make more money than dudes these days. <laughs> so which one got papers? Because I need papers if I'm gonna get y'all papers. The Let's Toros see. both have papers, right? The Toros have papers. And the white bubba. The Bubba's have papers. How much is this? I'm not gonna get it, but I'm just curious. So RM52, Turbion Skull. Uh, right now, $1.2 million. Mm. <laughs> I like this bubble, I ain't gonna lie, but I don't know if I want to spend a hundred bands. Is it worth it? It's preference. So, completely different watch than an ARM 11. Would you, buy it, with you. would you buy it if it was me? I would buy that over an ARM 11 myself, personally. I just like that size of watch. I myself enjoy wearing a little bit of smaller watches. So, ARM 11 being a little bit of a bigger watch, that would definitely be appealing to me. If I was gonna buy one though myself, I'll buy the black one. But that's because I like wearing all black. This one. But that pops more than the all black bubble. That's like very stealthy, you know. Not a lot. Of, well, actually, if you're wearing it, everyone's gonna know what it is. But if I was wearing like a black bubble, a lot of people would not even notice. Yeah. If I'm wearing that, they're gonna notice. But no matter what you wear, people are gonna notice it. That would do. That would subscribe. Do so. Would you subscribe if I did? If I had this on. That would do stand up. No. I remember. I remember shopping for these. Yeah. A year ago, them bitches was like 400. Niggas was telling me like 400. For those? So I'll, I'll give you perspective. It was around 400,000. It went all the way down to about 270,000. Now they're coming up a little bit more. So that's why they're around 300. Um, if you get quoted on that watch, people will quote you anywhere from like probably 300 all the way to 350. That's where people are going to quote you. So we're quoting you in the bottom of the spectrum. You actually just got that literally 30 minutes ago. Not even kidding. Just came in this morning. There's a watch. Yeah. Yeah, I like this one. I like this one too, though. Out of all the options that we do have, to be honest with you, the Bubba is probably your safest bet as far as holding value and having potential for legs to grow and for it to go up, in my opinion, just because it's such a classic piece. I mean, so many people love that watch and want that watch. When I was growing up and I saw Dan wearing that, I was like, damn, RM is crazy. They made me want one. At the time, they were probably like 2013, 60 or 80K. Not even kidding. You don't like this one. I like that watch. That's a good watch as well. I like I like the RM30. I like this one though, but this one, don't, you don't think this one good in value? No, I, I do think it is good in value, personally. But but uh, I just like to be honest, you know, I, I do like the RM11 on you. 
If I was gonna get something, I would get a bubble, to be honest with you. That's, that's where I would go. I would wanna go up like uh, to a bubble from there. And then after the bubble, you go up to something that's like four or 500,000, you know, from there. The cool part is too, if let's say you get that 30 and then in like three, four, five, six months, whatever it may be, you're like, yo, I wanna go back to an 11, you're close in price. They're not, it's not gonna, it's not gonna be like, if ARM 11 goes up a lot, the 30 will also go up. So you have to keep that in mind. But it's like ceramic or something. Right? So it's titanium, which makes it very light. And then on top of it is what's called DLC. It's kind of like wrapping your car, sort of. So it's aftermarket? No, it's factory, oh. factory wrap. It's like a, it's a very complicated process, but uh, essentially they use like, uh, like electricity to stick the black on top of the watch. Have you ever seen that before? Nah, it's hard. It's actually really nice. It's, it's, cool. it's, it's nice silver though. Nah, it's uh, <laughs> it's, 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 it's that, that new shit, that that uh, zirconium, cybramium shit. You gotta be. <laughs> <laughs> What's it called? The, 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 the cubic zirconia? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> that new shit. Huh? What is it? Aluminum foil? <laughs> Alright, don't don't do too much. <laughs> don't do too much. You did low key have the blue outfit ready for the blue watch. Yeah, no, I like this one. I don't, everybody else don't like it, but I like this one. You might as well do a straight up trade for this. I love that watch, personally. We could get we could get close to someone. Maybe what you mean? Close. You're already making money. Actually, I think we're losing money on that watch. I'm yeah, being very honest with you. I think we are losing money on that watch. But it's okay. It's an RM11. We don't, it's an RM's only. We don't we sell like based on what we pay for. Like, so like, we we RM, sell based on the market. So for instance, but if we, we paid 250 for that, I can show you. and the yeah, market went to 200, we're yeah, not going to sell it for 250. Yeah, we're going to sell it for 200. this one around the time when I bought this? This one up as high as around 260, 270. At its top, top, top peak. When RM30s that were limited were very, very, very hot. They're still very hot. The highest I saw one of those was in the mid this mid 200s, like 260, 255, 260. To be honest, yeah, I know it's hella nice and shit, but I'm just as, as, as an incentive to trade. Um, you're gonna see a lot more Arm 11s than you're gonna like, see that watch. If you so saw like someone else wearing that watch, yeah. I'd be and shocked. That's never gonna go down. Like there's just almost I no mean, way that's never gonna reach you wearing that. So that's also something to take into sure. consideration. Yeah. This is not a common a watch. Large account you know, it's an expensive, serious yeah. watch, but a lot of people who are successful yeah. and like RMs have an Arm 11. But not a lot of them have that watch. This just seemed like it costs more. This is more flashy. RM works inversely, so. Precious metals like rose gold are always going to be worth less than like NTPT or ceramic or something like that. Guess how much you think this is? Like just off holding it and, and looking at it. This bitch feel like a fucking. This has got a flappy band on. <laughs> it's an iFit band. What the fuck? Feels like you're going to break it, but you won't. <laughs> this is looking Feels hard. like nothing, right? Yeah. Nah, I know this shit probably like 600. No, but it's it's two eighty. Two eighty. Yeah. Two eighty. That's okay, straight. What is new? That is preempt. So Formula One drivers like to wear this watch because it's lightweight. You can do anything in it. Work out and stuff. You literally never have to worry about. Yeah, that. like I wear mine to the gym every day. I don't, like I don't that's not care. Just, that's a cool little flex. Yeah. yeah. I'm like a Richard. I know, right? <laughs> like, <laughs> not because it, it's so versatile. You know, you don't yeah. feel it. It's like meant for stuff like that. Yeah. It's crazy. Wow. This bitch feel like a damn piece of paper. You need to get that new strap though. Yeah, that strap is run down. So you're 19 now? I'm, no, 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 I got a couple years, I'm 22. 22, wow. Yeah, same age as me. I was gonna say, well, yeah, nine, that's 19 years old, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, Even at 22 years old, it's crazy. Congratulations, that's... Thanks. No, but what I'll do is I'll give you my number and then no matter what, where you are in the world, if you have a question, you just let me know. Be yeah, like, most hey, someone offered me this or I'm at this store mm -hmm. and I'm happy to, to put you on game for yeah, it and let you know. Definitely. I'm thank always you. happy to help people do that. Thank you, thank Cause sometimes at the store, if you get something, they'll offer you something that's not so great. Yeah. And I can help you navigate that out of that. Good, you know, yeah. like, hey, ask them for this or yeah. don't buy that. Um, I'm really trying to do the mm -hmm. best I can for that. Thank you, man. Thank of course, you, bro, I got you. Cause we've had customers do crazy stuff. Like they've been traveling, they'll call us, hey, I got offered this, should I buy it? Yeah. I'm like, hell yeah, you should buy it. Yeah. It's a great, sure. great opportunity. You're gonna give me this for even. Um, let me see one thing. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, no, do you have a do you have a picture of the papers by any chance? I have do you know the year? I have oh, you have the actual, yeah, I got the actual papers. 
You want to, so you want to do a straight trade. Mm -hmm. I want a $5,000 difference. <clears throat> so would you like to flip a coin to see what we can do? Either $5,000 my way or a straight trade. Okay. I think that's fair? All right. Okay. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> and you can flip the coin. All right. Let's see. You have a, you have a, actually, I have a coin. I got his, yeah. That's I have a coin from the <laughs> Unless you have a coin, you can use your own coin so you don't think I'm doing some, nah, I'll some weird stuff. I ain't tripping no five. Though. Yo, you got the double sided one? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That coin dude look a little big! Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> like that's not no yeah, regular yeah. coin! That, that, that's, it's good, it's from the casino, I promise. All right, oh, you, yeah, gotta, yeah. You, gotta, you gotta call in the air. Okay. You let it hit the ground or? It has to hit the yeah, ground. Yeah, the ground. Okay. So either, all right, so let's let's tell everyone what we're doing. So we have the RM30 Blackout for the RM11 Rose Gold and Titanium. Either you owe me 5,000 or it's a straight trade. Yeah. Right? All right, let's do it, bro. Let's see what we can do. All right, flipper, 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 hey, it's... Tail! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we'll do, let's do two out of three. Okay. Damn, he a real Rin one! <laughs> Rin he's, he's a real one, that's oh, crazy! Shit. Okay, okay. Okay. I believe myself. Okay. Hey, it's... Hello? <laughs> 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 It rolled off my foot. <laughs> I tried, bro. I tried. I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> sorry. Bro, you, you, you flip it so weird. Like a coin. <laughs> hey, I told you, bro. <laughs> you, this nigga flipping it like this. Yeah, I'm sick. What are you flipping it I'm so sick weird? As fuck. All, right, all right, last one, bro. Three out of five. <laughs> you want me to flip it? No, no. You have, you have all right. You <laughs> How am I supposed to flip it? This thing like Put a kid! Right <laughs> like this? Yeah, just flick it, boom. It's finna land on heads. Heads. Boom. Alright, you gotta, you gotta do a runner runner. You gotta do the so runner runner. Just do it, alright. So you got. It's two to one. It's two okay, to one. Okay, okay. Oh, heads. Oh, it's a nail biter. Come on, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what do we got? One more flip? Yeah. Probability. Motherfucker. God, hey, <laughs> damn, Ed's the deal. Oh, oh. He gave Congrats. it to me, though. Good luck. Three heads. That nigga gave it to me. I don't Three even heads. know what the odds of getting three heads in a row are, but that's nah, very, that's very lucky. That is very lucky. Like, nah, you gotta want this pink strap or I got other straps. Oh, we, you can you can give that to us and we'll give you like 30 straps if you want so it fits that piece. Then you Damn, want he's got the whole arm boutique yeah, in there. I'll be reaching. I'll be taking my shit off and everything. That's so. Yeah, you can give us that strap and then you can pick out some ones you like. I kind of like the pink though, I'm not gonna lie. Is that gonna fit on the 30? No. It's not gonna fit on the 30. Yeah. Oh, this don't fit on the 30. So, all the straps that fit on this will not fit on this. These, they, although they look the same, they're not actually the same this, strap. Yeah, that's smaller. Oh, yeah, so which really ones? So any anything in here will fit a 30 or <coughs> we have any other 30 and straps. Then, see, like on the back of the straps, it tells you about the model. So oh, that's okay, all okay. for 11. Right, so that means these are up way less. These are 32. Oh, we have a 30. Yo, we have a Velcro though. 30. Have you, ever, have you ever worn a Velcro? Mm -mm. It's sick. You might like it a lot, actually. I have to see it. We can, we can put it on for you and you can try it if you want. But this is the only pink we have for 30. Oh, I wish I had the papers for this one. That's really nice, right? The condition on that one is really nice too, though. This one? Yeah, it's really, really, really nice. No, nah, that was hard. I like baby blue. That's my favorite color. I can I'm gonna switch the colors though. I think baby blue is one of the hardest colorways on that. And the yeah. fact that you came dressed, we're ready to wear that watch is uh, it's meant to be. That's super shit. Where'd you get that hoodie from, by the way? Oh, because I've never seen it. Like, you got it in LA? I got it from here actually. In Miami? That was the yeah. CLP collection. Damn, I got it. Oh, okay. Yeah. That makes sense though. Yeah, Drake, my cousin, I got it for the free skin and shit. So how are we gonna do the straps? So I just give you these and then you just give me the same colors back or? Uh, whatever whatever makes you happy. We can do that if you'd like. Or, um, yeah, I'm down, I'm down to do that 100%. Yeah, we can, we can trade or we can, um, if you wanna get a new color, we're also cool to do that too. If you wanted to do orange, we have the orange set up. This is 30? That's for a 30. Okay. That would actually look really nice on that yeah, watch, to be honest with you. In your papers. 
And then of course it has the number out of 30. I don't know if 22 means anything to you, but it's number 22 out of 30. It's only 30 of these? 30 pieces in the world. Mm. How many pieces of these? So those are numbered. If I had to guess, quite a few, probably 400 maybe. So we have the green green we could do. We have the orange orange, at least for now, you know, and of course I'll get you whatever color you want. Uh, the lighter green, we also have the dark blue. I just bought this pink too. What this is really pink? nice. Yeah, that's all right. But if you, if you like the Velcro, we could switch the pink for that Velcro. Mm. At least for now, whatever makes yeah. it, whatever Until makes we can get the rubber and then we just straight trade yeah, that that's back. Cool. You know? That's cool for now. Yeah. yeah, you have the tool in there too. It's yeah. actually mad funny. That's the same setup that we were having. Yeah, right. I have a bag exactly like that with the same shit. Yeah. Like all straps for my watch and I told it. I like to trade them so I like buy a bunch of them. Yeah. So I trick all my supporters so they think I'm rich and I'm really poor. <laughs> it's better to trade them. 100%. Yeah. I've been trading them since I got them. I haven't. Well, I never had two riches at once. What was the first one you had and then you traded them? 30. 30 rose gold titanium. Yeah. That's a good trade. To get into that one. Yeah, but I had. I bought it when it was low. I got it. 30. Yeah. 130,000. Yeah, that's cheap. <laughs> so you've been collecting RM for a while now. For a right, man, like almost five years. Yeah. And then the, we have red too, if you want. I know this is large. This is not gonna fit you. This is a large too. Ooh, I want that green though. But this w maybe would fit, right? Yeah. On the last hole? Yeah. It's possible, yeah. I think it fit. All right, no problem. Let me, let me, can we? We can try it. Yeah. Yeah. You got, do you, or you got an RM that already got a large on it? Uh, yeah. yeah, for sure we do. Yeah, this fit. Does it fit? Last one. Yeah, it's really, it's actually closer than this. This might be for the 11, actually. Yeah, that's it, that RM. 11 quick, huh? Um, to be honest with you, we're going to send it now for service and polish. We're going to make it look like really nice and um, probably sell it for 195 to be honest with you. probably what we're gonna do. Appreciate it, man. Of course, bro. Of nice course. doing business. You gotta flip that around, though. Or you like to wear it like that. Oh, no, I'm tripping. I'll wear it. Yeah, like yeah. the, new, the new style you wear it. Who taught you to, you're a lefty? Nah, I'm a lefty. Oh, okay, lefty. I was about to say. That's how the boy wears his watches. The on boy? His, yeah, on his right wrist. Who's the boy, Drake? Yeah. You wear it on his right wrist? I, I wear mine that. on my right. I peeped that. For Why did you do that? that? I don't know. Actually, I should ask him. To be honest with you, that that that's actually a really interesting question. But it's just like preference. Like even even, even me, I wear mine on my right. I've noticed he that. He said something about so it. He's the only person that's brought that up. I've always noticed that. Drake right. versus watches on his right fist. I've always noticed that when they're sitting. That's crazy. Maybe because he want to shake your hand mm -hmm. with the richer ones. That's smart nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see that bitch unless you. You know what I'm saying? Do we have? Do we yeah, have? Like, oh, shit. Shit. Oh. Shit. If you had to guess, how much money you think these both of these boxes is? All together. I want to guess like around nine, nine point five million. That's nine. That's ten million right there. Right here. Both. So you have to remember, like a million, one point two million, three hundred thousand. So right there, one, two, like three million right there. Three. three, first three watches. Four, five. This is a million alone. Six. Is that factory set? Factory set, Turbion. Retail is 960,000. So right here is almost $7 million alone. And then like, for instance, this watch, half a million dollars, half a million dollars, half a million dollars, over half a million dollars. Adds up quick. Uh, 10 million. That's crazy. You make that on SWAT though, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> you seen SWAT? You ever watch SWAT? Of course. You lying. You lying. You've seen 100%. Swat before? I haven't I haven't seen you though. Damn! Oh! Damn! How many Wait, you last you get on that bitch? Maybe maybe like 15, 20 minutes of it max. Swat. How many lines did you get on SWAT? I was on there for five years. You know who Darrow is on SWAT? Do you know SWAT? No, I, I honestly don't know anything about the show. I think I watch it for like 15, 20 That's minutes. That's what I'm saying. You gotta ask somebody who watch it, bro. Yeah, I know SWAT. Yeah, I watch SWAT. You ever heard of Moonwalking in Calabasas? Of course. Emmett. That nigga talking about Of course. You watched SWAT before? No. Nah. How about this? I'm gonna go SWAT? home. I'm gonna watch two, three hours of it. Yeah, and I'll text you. I'll text you and I'll be Let like, yo. Know. 
Thank you so much for everything. I appreciate you coming down. Enjoy your time in Miami. If you need anything, let me know. I'll keep you touch. Congratulations. Enjoy it, bro. Nice to meet you guys. So nice meeting you. I'm going to go check you out tonight. I promise. Take care. Thank you. 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 Thank you